Good morning, everyone. Strafe Gal, playing some more for a vast future. And we are heading into the obligatory mine area. What's the story with this place? From what I've heard, the Golden Hand has been going into towns and taking captives. Anybody who doesn't want to join the cult gets put to work in the mine. I knew those people were bad news. It sounds as though the captives are fighting back. Scumbag cultists taking advantage of innocent people makes me sick. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I have something that might help us. Delay. These bullets will come in handy against large enemy groups. Uh, I suspect I understand what this means. Use B to slow a target down. We'll fall back in the turn order and become stuck. Okay, awesome. Less pronounced on bosses and delay bullets have significantly less damage in exchange for the slow effect. At this point on, enemies may now drop delay bullets in addition to other special ammo. So because of the way that the... I'm going to wait until I'm actually in a battle. Oh, why did it do that? That was weird. Okay, that's what I was trying to do. Apparently if you hold R before it gets to your turn, it doesn't work. But if you hold R during your turn, you can see that bar at the top. So theoretically, if we use a delay bullet on the closest guy. Yep, we see him get moved back in the order. Cool. I don't actually need to do any more delays on this fight, I don't think. But I may do... Yeah, let's chuck a Molotov over here. Just to finish the other two off. Let's just do a crit on this guy. Cool. Basic burn and scrap. Awesome. Still looking for gears. Um, got our second revive. That's good. Scan the dust bunny since we haven't seen these before. No strengths, no weaknesses. Cool. Actually, I'm gonna have her use explosive. <coughs> cool. Not what I was hoping, but. I forgot to switch her bullets back. I do kind of wish it defaulted to... Cool discard. You're not supposed to be here. Okay, I'm assuming this is going to be, like, actual slightly harder fight?
Smoke bomb worked out really well there. Let's go ahead and do a scan. Just so we can get this down. Weakness to explode. Perfect. And it looks like they use charm effects. So definitely want to focus that guy down. So I'm assuming this guy's gonna be more on the physical side. And since he's already blind, that gives us a pretty good option there. should be able to just finish her finish it off cool we got a crystal for it got the last scope upgrade that was a mistake I didn't realize it was gonna keep the same target. Um, I'll just chuck a Molotov to finish that guy off. Blood suck. Ugh. Okay. the good news there is that I was already poisoned. <laughs> uh, 29 to 46 damage means we can't finish one of the other ones off with this ammo. 36 to 57, that'd be a real slim chance. I don't think we know what these guys are weak against yet, because I misclicked. So I think we're just going to stick with basic and finish this guy off. Weakness to fire and ice. Figures. I'm gonna aim at that one. Chance to stun would have been good if it hit. <laughs> it didn't, but that's okay. And we'll go with burn on this guy just to finish it off. And now we finish this one. on the monk. And... Molotov? Just to finish him off. Acolyte. Weak to explode as well. Awesome. Cultist healer, general and very glad we took that attack when we did. Three more first aids. Uh, that actually is really nice. Because I was literally just thinking about using some first aids, but I wasn't sure if I wanted to. And it giving me three is kind of perfect. There's some gears finally. What are these guys? The other biker-esque enemies we ran into were weak to explosive, so I figured we'd try the same thing, and it worked. Um, I think we can just, well, we can't quite finish them off, actually, which surprises me a little. 
guess let's see if we can... Oh, look at resist. Okay. What are these guys like? Electric or taser? Cool. Guaranteed kill on that guy. Very unlikely on that guy. So yeah, we'll finish off the one we know we can actually finish off. I mean, my general strategy with anything is gonna be If I have the option to finish something on, especially if it's the next thing, which in this case it wasn't, but just putting it out there as a part of the exercise, thought exercise, I guess, is my prioritization is generally going to be first at the... Oh my, I have a lot. Let's go ahead and get another dexterity, another marksmanship. Um, I'm gonna grab one luck. Time, I think we're just gonna put one in each of these. I'm still kind of gonna just play into that role for now. And then I'm gonna give her one more marksmanship and another armor and evasion. Um, the reason we're going with that, so armor and evasion, um, because she has low speed, I want to put her, I want her to be able to get her attacks off, even if she has to go after the enemies. So giving her a little bit more armor, a little bit more evasion helps with that. Um, where on the other hand, Dar, getting luck, he always goes first. Um, which means he's the more likely to end up using our resources than she is. That's kind of terrifying. Uh, chance to one-shot these guys. Um, these guys are more likely to be one-shot, but they have lowered... Yeah, yeah, I think we start off on those guys. And then... We let the grenades... Come in. That's a chance to kill. This is a guaranteed kill. Perfect. Now, I may end up having to deal with a charm effect here, but it's not super likely. I don't want to let it get back around to that uh, charm turn. And there's some more gears. Nice. This looks like somebody we can actually talk to. You saved me. I don't believe it. Do you work for the Golden Hand? No way. We're the Golden Hand's worst nightmare, and you're free to go. We'll take care of things here. You get out of here and find safety. Thank you. Here's a helpful hint. Tasers can deal lethal damage to robots, depending on the user's dexterity. They can also damage non-robots with a wet status. Oh, okay. Cool. So these are robots. I will also say these are the same are these are the same robots we've run into before, just higher tier. Instant shutdown. Okay, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna guess this is gonna work as well. Okay. Molotov, explosive, and a gear. 
go ahead and grab some resources. And we'll sneak up behind this guy. No brakes allowed. That guy's really, f like, obnoxiously fast. Let's get back to TNT and see if we can one-shot. Let's one-shot the... That's a guaranteed one-shot against the healer. That feels okay. Grenade on the monk. I don't think I ever actually scanned this guy. Because his weakness wasn't coming up. Yeah, these explosive bullets are definitely top tier here. I feel like I might have enough already for something else. I'm wrong, but I was thinking it might be a possibility. Technically, I guess I could give uh, one of them a, like, a secondary boost. I'm gonna work on it though. We have to start there. Crystal, thanks for your help. We're gonna revolt. The Man Eater's days are numbered. The Man Eater is what they call the mutated beast who runs the mines, keeps these people captive, working them day and night. Let's put an end to this tyranny. Chell, you are showing. Show, it seems you are showing signs of empathy. The Man Eater is not far ahead, and he's gathered up the townsfolk. I fear what happens next. Sounds like we have some work ahead of us. That looks like the man-eater over there. So I want to actually go the other way first. That was a crit. We'll take it. Wish we had a... Wish we had an explosive that hit more than one enemy. I think actually... Can utilize Molotov there. That'll get him low enough that even Tarn can finish him off. Then should be able to finish it off with basic ammo, which means we can maintain our resources. I wanted to check down here quick first. Because it looks like, yep, treasure chests. That's five guys. Okay. Great for burgers, not for RPGs. Shh. 
pretty good odds of... Oh my gosh, that was a low roll. Another crystal. I'm glad to at least see we're getting gears, though. There's our zap grenade schema, so I'm very glad we came over here. That would have been really annoying. Interesting that they just put a Junkotron here for us. Um, so we do have enough to make more Molotovs. We've got five Molotovs right now. Let's go ahead and grab some more. And I'm also going to grab some more... Uh, actually, what are these do? Buff defense. Okay. And those are crystals. Individual crystals for one. Oh, one crystal for three vitamins. Uh, I don't think that's probably worth it right now. But I will grab some more remedies. When I, it happens when you skip a snake, apparently. You end up 10 points short of getting everybody's uh, next tier of skills. definitely has a very nice rhythm to it. Um, as we're going, like, I can definitely, like, it's really easy to follow whose turn it's going to be once you get into each fight, um, and to just generally have an idea of how that moves, which I think is neat and important for a good JRPG combat system. Passage is blocked. What is that thing? That's the man eater. It's like the only way out is through. Ready for this or what? Let's do it. We've come too far. Gormulus. Ah, fresh meat. Well, the metallic one doesn't look too tasty. The rest of you, though. You've already had your last meal. You're a little small, but you'll make a nice appetizer. Good luck with that. Enough talk, I'm hungry. Okay. So we don't know what their weakness is yet. Um, I think the first thing we're gonna do is Start with Dar using a delay. Just to buy us a little bit more time to get that info and to establish what we're doing. Um, I think for her, since we don't know the weakness yet, I'm just going to use a rocket. We have one, it causes massive explode damage. I don't know what that means yet. But anything that does massive damage is probably good. Because it's going to take a turn. So now we scan. We hope he doesn't say resist, explode. He is resistant to explode. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, he's also not weak to anything. Um, so what I'm actually going to do here... 
is chuck an oil can at him. Ooh, okay. to 86. And let's do burn, since we've got the oil on him. Resistant, but a weakness, so I don't know if that worked or how that balances out, but. Good enough. I don't want to throw any more explosives at him. Um. I don't have a good fire weapon outside of Molotovs. Those are good AoE, but not... So I think I'm actually going to switch over to water. And we're going to do... Shock damage. Now we don't have a good way to follow that up here. At the very back of his turn right now. Chance to cause stun. Chance to cause blind. Zap grenades, since he's got the water on him. Um, we're gonna have him use a first aid kit on Pent. She's got the ammo. Let's keep firing. Zap grenade. Got a freebie. Awesome. First aid on Dar. Still six zap grenades, so we'll just keep going with that. We're hitting the weakness that we created here. And it looks like that's it, actually. So we'll have to do some more water. Vermilis is hungry. That sounds dangerous, but he's down to 200 health. So I think what I'm going to do here, I'm going to increase crit chance on Dar missed somehow. I thought we took this... What? Oh, we can't hit him while he's hungry. I guess. Probably should have paid more attention. Okay, so that just literally doesn't do anything. If he's hungry, he'll eat anything you throw at him. Okay, so I guess we just bandage. Gotcha. He'll eat anything you throw at him. I guess we just keep chucking grenades until he stops. It's like his turn next, so I think I'm gonna just bandage her. 
uses digest and he just took 200 and some damage. Okay, cool. That is exactly what I needed. Seventeen damage to finish it off. Gah, I've lost my appetite. You've saved us. We're in your debt. You can repay us by kicking those cultists out of town. Five crystals. There's the exit to the turnpike. See, it was easy. Easy is not the correct word for this occasion. <laughs> What's that over there? What do we have here? The Scrambler. Army used these for rough, travel rough terrain. Could be helpful. We probably have quite a few miles to go. Anyone know how to drive this thing? Ooh, me. I used to ride on the motorbikes the army left behind in Greensburg. Got rid of the cultists. What's in it for you? I wish that was the last of them. I'm sure they're on to their next scheme. We can still work together. I'll drive. Fine, you helped us get that far. Let's go. Here's the scrambler. Would you like a tutorial? Yes. Push B to get on or off. When riding the scrambler, you'll travel faster, but you can't enter buildings. The bike sub-menu has been unlocked. You can select previously visited location to instantly travel there. Hogtown, Scrapyard, Hogstown Gate, Goldenhead Monastery, Green Spring. Okay, so I'm not gonna go anywhere yet. Also, there's a chest up here. Saw a group of cultists headed east towards Coville. Finally, are right, leaving all their belongings behind at the monastery. They're finally gone. Oh, okay. Not sure who you are, but cool. I'm just trying to, just trying to get to the next spot here. Not sure. I love it just because it's a little tricky to control. General Chirk, what do we do now? Those pesky cultists have evacuated Greenspring. I do not know why or where they're headed. Ah, it reports suggested they're headed east to Coville. No matter, they're not a concern any longer. Perhaps they have an interest in the abandoned satellite tower? I said no matter. Capital City ordered us to ensure the turnpike is unobstructed from Hogtown to Silvington. But, but what if they get a hold of the tower? Enough. Those cultists don't operate a machine if their lives de couldn't operate a machine if their life depended on it. Yes, sir, you're right. We must return to Silvington and report back. The operation must continue. Okay. The operation? The civilian government is up to something. I just don't know what. How do you know so much anyway? I, uh, no time to argue. We need to get to Silvington and figure out what's going on so I can find my origin as well. That'd be enough scrap to life last a lifetime in Silvington. Silvington should be near. I mean, it shouldn't be. There's another town first, but okay. Grab down extender and another rocket. Vampire bullets. Bullets? Or is that a death bomb of some kind? Last art. Silvington base. Okay. Uh, that is not what I was expecting. But. 
Yeah. Where's this other town in between? Oh well. The important part is that we can now fast travel back to Sylvington and uh, make our way back here to, what is it, Greenspring? So, this seems like a good spot to break. Next time, we will probably be doing a little party reorganization, depending on what upgrades are available through those uh, new weapon up weapon mods that I picked up. So, hopefully you're still enjoying. If you are, please give me a like and subscribe. Check out the other content on my channel. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments. And as always, have a good one. We'll catch you next time.